What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nora and thank you so much for watching. Before we jump into today's video, be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, follow your girl on Instagram because you know we are growing the family across all platforms. So obviously you guys see the title. Today's video is going to be a weekend in my life vlog. I feel like I haven't vlogged in forever. Um, I'll tell you a major like reason for that is because if you guys watched my last video um which would have been i think it was my girl talk video about like being toxic um i was in the process of interviewing and looking for a new job which i was able to land so um i took a little bit of time just to focus on that so i figured why not let's vlog um i am off the next week so i don't start work until the 22nd today is the 12th so today is the oh can't even get my watch out yeah, today's the 12th. So um, I've got some time off in between starting my new job. So I'm gonna just get like caught up on things, uh, run some errands, kind of try to get myself situated before starting the new position. Um, it's about 12.30 now. Um, I'm actually getting ready to go get an, um, not an oil change, I was about to say an oil change, an inspection sticker for my mom. Um, I have her car right now. So I'm just gonna go take care of that for her in the meantime. Um, and yeah, I think I'm supposed to be meeting up with my cousins tonight over at Cynthia's house later on. So probably share that with you guys. And again, just figured why not vlog? So hopefully you guys enjoy this video and yeah, let's go get this uh, inspection done. <laughs> All right, sis is back at the house. Let me put this down a little bit. I'm watching YouTube as always. Let me straighten y'all out. Okay, so I just got back to the house. Um, let me tell you guys, I freaking hate going to the, um, what do you call it? Where the hell was I just at? Like the car, like auto, auto body shop or whatever, because they stay trying to like hustle you and tell you all this other shit is wrong with your car. And that really aggravates me. And obviously I went there to take my mom's car. And they're just asking me mad questions, like trying to check out mad stuff. And I was like, I did not come here and ask y'all to, to do all of this, okay? Do the mother effing inspection. Don't start telling me about other stuff that's going on because I don't wanna hear it. So yeah, anyway, so did that. Um, back at the house now. Um, just going to make something to eat. I haven't eaten anything today. I had a coffee and that was about it. And it's 1.45 now. Um, so probably, I don't even know what I'm gonna eat. I'm just gonna whip up something real quick, tidy up my house a little bit. I have like been in and out of my house over the last couple weeks. I've been back and forth at my mom's house, like helping her out with some stuff. Every single week she tells me to go over there, we're gonna do some home improvements and we fake don't do anything. So your girl's been like back and forth to my mom's house a lot. So I feel like my place definitely needs to be clean. My floors need to be mopped. Um, and then I'm gonna shoot some content today for Instagram. Um, I'm actually filming another video kind of around that shooting content at home. Uh, so you guys will see that video probably after this goes live. So have to do that, do my makeup, all that good stuff. Um, I still have a bag of clothes sitting over here that I brought back from my mom's house like a week ago that I still haven't cleaned, so there's that. And um, yeah, so that's about it. So I'm gonna hop into that and then I'll probably tap in with you guys once I'm like, ready to start taking pictures. Obviously, like I mentioned, I'm not gonna share all of that in this video because that will be a separate video on how I shoot content for the gram at home. So, uh, yeah. Feel uninvited, left home in West LA. I'm not excited. So I wanted to give a shout out to my bestie Jasmine who sent me some like congratulatory gifts. Um, like I mentioned obviously earlier in the video already, I'm starting a new job which I'm like so excited about Bittersweet because I loved the company that I worked for before. I uh, had been there almost seven years. So I mean a lot of time with them, worked with them in Dallas, worked with them here in Boston. but. New chapter, moving on, and Jasmine definitely was like a huge like push in that and just being like, girl, 
step out on faith, take a leap, and let's just do it. So she got me this really nice candle that says congrats on it. Um, it's from Sweet Water Decor. If I can find it, I'll link it down below for you guys. This is like a tropical fruit and sugared citrus candle. Really excited about this because actually um, it's locally made. Well, not locally, like Massachusetts. It's made in the U.S. And it actually has a cotton wick, which I've never seen or heard of a candle with a cotton wick. Oh, it smells amazing. I actually might burn this today in my kitchen. This is a really good kitchen scent. And then she got me this fire ass mug. Absolutely love this. It just says, boss, a woman who prays, slays, makes her own money, minds her own business, does her best, and trusts God for the rest. Love this. Y'all know I love me a good mug. So, Jasmine, thank you very much. Love you to the moon and back. And, uh, yeah, let's jump back in. This summer, just want to touch like back when we were younger. Yeah. Why don't you love me, love me, love me? Touch me, touch me, touch me. now it's like 6 30 um i finished filming another video like i mentioned already earlier it was like shooting content at home for instagram all that good stuff so by the time this goes up mm, no this will be up before that video but so makeup is done i am all dressed let me just show you guys real quick what i am wearing please hold so i think i mentioned earlier that i am heading over to my cousin sin's place Cynthia and Rochelle are hosting us tonight. We're doing just like a little girls night thing. Um, so heading over there. So I am just wearing this cropped hoodie from my fave, Musanda Apparel. Um, I will be sure to include their information in the bottom bar description box down below. They are actually currently hosting a raffle. Uh, this is going up on Sunday, Valentine's Day. So hopefully we're not too late, but if the raffle is still going on, I will be sure to include the information down below. Uh, it's like $10 to enter the raffle, and if you win, you win a hoodie, uh, Musanda tea, and then a mask as well, which you guys know, I've got like two of them literally sitting here. The Musanda masks are my favorite. So uh, yeah, got this cropped hoodie. Uh, jeans are from Gap. Uh, they're just like these um, like acid wash kind of like black jeans from Gap, and then you already know my favorite boots from Public Desire. Listen, I'm gonna wear these until we are blue in the face. So Sabrina's on her way now, so we will check in with you guys when we get to uh, Sin and Rochelle's. All right, so we made it. I said Sin and Rochelle's because I figured Rochelle would be here, but Rochelle is not here, Rochelle's so we've made it here. here. Here at the spot, Hi. family's Hi. here. Ladies, Hi. obviously, saying hello. Hi. Where are you? Hi. Hi. We're here. Hi. Now, these are mad cute. Hi, I know. Last minute. So cute. So yeah. Nice little cousin's night. So we will check in with you guys. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, he's the one. Touch me, touch me, touch
that's what people were getting. People were getting upset because it's like you guys are taking advantage. How about a ginger pussy? Yeah, that's what I was putting on my house. And I get hustled saying good. Nah, it was crazy. The whole thing is like really sad. And yeah, when the whole breakup happened with um, Justin because she was a virgin, but again, men being misogynistic, like Justin went like on like radio shows and was like, well, I mean, at least I got a chance to hit it. At least I got to smash. And they showed like all these magazine covers and all these things. And it was just like, they Crimea destroyed River. this little, yep, Crimea River came out. And that's what it was about, was about Britney and all this stuff. Like, oh, you cheated on me. Yeah. If you watch the video back again, the girls literally dressed exactly like I Britney. knew that. that yeah, was, I knew that too. I, yeah, I, I, I knew that. that. I remember that. Yeah. I, remember I knew that, that too. Because yeah. I, I watched it with my mom. And my mom was like, I never knew that was about her. So I played the video for my mom after. And she was like, oh, how did I miss that? I'm like, it's literally Britney. Like, I remember. Yeah. So he finally made a... Uh, yeah. And he made one too. Was it um, Janet Jackson? Yeah, he too? talked. To, yeah, he talked yeah. about both of them. That's the one thing I don't understand. What happened? I know that he made her do it, or he well, did it, it on accident. It was purposely, or it, was on it looked like no. It was cool. definitely by accident. The issue that a lot of people have, though, is that he didn't necessarily stand united with her. Janet Jackson got blackballed from the freaking um, the Super Bowl moving forward, and he was able to perform a couple years later. Oh, okay. So it's like, and then when people asked him about it and in interviews, he always kind of played it off again, just being a man. Like, oh yeah, well, ha, ha, super funny, but yeah, I'm going to be back in a couple of years to the Super Bowl now that you know she's been blackballed ever since something that both of you were involved in. Right, right, and that's what he talks about in his apology. He was like, you know, my privilege, me being a white man in America is what's allowed me to continue moving forward. And at the same time, I'm not giving my counterpart who was, you know, damaged at the same time the same respect from it. So that's kind of what he was saying. Yeah. Did you guys be careful, Jasmine. Yours on the edge. Super cute. Are you ready? Oh, yeah, I already undid my bow. But my cousin so Vanessa, I got a special box. Thumbnail, thumbnail. Mm. Cute. <laughs> right. Oh my god. Y'all yeah, not going fast enough. Y'all not going fast enough. Yeah. Hey. Because I'm going to definitely be using that. You know a bitch love a good candle. Mm -hmm. Yes. Nice. This is so cute, Wait, I already Ooh. know I'm about to love this. My sister's getting married. Oh, this smells bomb. This is so cute. Oh, oh this smells. So fast for you me. like the smell? You know this is right in my yeah. alley. This okay. She knew what to do. Perfectly. She knew what to do with the candle. Oh, that smells amazing. Do we all have the same candle? Mm -hmm. The same yeah. scent, but Nessa's oh, your okay. candles. Oh, my candle. gosh. <laughs> You're pretty. Thank you. Yes. It's gonna be cute for day of when we have our little essentials. <laughs> when you're gonna need like you know any of your little stuff. Oh, then we have some so champagne. Good. Okay. All right, A little everybody? champagne. All right. I'm getting some cards. Mm -hmm. You're pretty. Are we supposed to open them right now? The the card card now? Card, yeah. Uh -huh. I love this. <gasps> Hashtag getting married, hashtag shit just got real, hashtag bridesmaid, hashtag pretty please, hashtag no ugly dresses, hashtag promise. <laughs> yeah. As long as there's no ugly dresses. Yes, and thank so you. Cute. I'm so excited. Oh, I'm so excited. We're about to be big. Yeah. We're about to be mad cute. Just don't put us in no ugly shoes. I'm about to have a weave. Listen, yeah. your, hair, your hair better be sweeping the floor. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to get my body done. I'm going to get ready. I'm out here. Wait, I, love put this. I love this box. This I'm definitely so keeping cute. this because this is a really good like organization yeah, box. Cute. And it Thank you, Cindy. Uh, black and white theme. Yeah. My first wedding. I don't know. Wait, really? Was your first wedding? Um, I was in a, who's, was it the Trinity? Oh, yeah. Y'all <laughs> yeah, have all been in weddings before? Yes. Yeah. A lot. I've been in a few. Why nobody put me in the wedding? My ass is on her way to fucking 27 dresses like a motherfucker. <laughs> mm. I just been in a lot. You would be the one though. Yeah, a lot. <laughs> Damn, I'm putting this shit right in the fridge when I get home because I'm popping that shit tonight. <laughs> I'll give it to my mama. 
This is so cute. I'm gonna be like this in the crib. Like, eh. oh, oh, I would like for a second, I got freaked out. I'm like, are these coming mm -hmm. out? No, <laughs> no, they move. Yeah, it's they like double. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I love this. Bride Squad. Okay. And I like Bride that it has squad. the little um, straw thing, too. Yeah. What? I think it is. I think that's what it is. So yeah. the date is officially you February 26th. Huh? The date? Yeah. Oh, slide. Yeah, yeah. Guys. Good morning, beautiful people. It is Saturday. Um, I am up and getting ready to go get my nails done. Long overdue. Um, again, just between like interviewing, getting settled with that stuff. Um, yeah, I just like took forever. So I'm gonna get my nails done. I'm not so sure what I'm gonna do yet, but gonna take you guys along with me. Um, I'm going to just make a coffee real quick. As always, for my coffee, you guys know I love the iced coffee medium roast, or excuse me, blonde roast from Starbucks. I just like to get this. I feel like I save money because this, I think, is like $4.99, five bucks like from the grocery store. And if I order an actual coffee from Starbucks every day, it's like seven bucks. So we save in coins, chef. And then I'm just using the uh, Silk Almond Creamer, um, sweet and creamy. I just use a little bit of that. Or a lot. <laughs> or a lot. Um, yeah, I just like to add that in. Got my nice little glass straws. I got these from Amazon. If they are still available, I will link them down below. And that's literally it. That's my coffee. So gonna enjoy that. Um, I'll probably check in with you guys either, hmm, either in the car or I'll check in with you guys once I actually get to the nail salon. What do you do when you are 30 minutes early for a nail appointment? Home goods. <laughs> I need a new trash for my bathroom but I haven't been able to find anything that I like. Let's see. So much in here. Like that one back there, but I don't know if I really like that texture. But I do kind of like this one. So, I don't really know. There's none over here. None. Like, I normally like these, but I don't know if I like that that much. I don't know if I like this that much. It's heavy, it's really nice, but I don't really know. So I'm sitting in the car right now and I just have to keep telling myself, I love my nail tech, I love my nail tech, I love my nail tech, I love my nail tech because Okay, so I got to the nail salon early. That's my fault. I had my appointment saved in my phone as 10.30. It was for 11, which is fine. I got here at like 10.20, 10.25. So I'm like, all right, cool. I'm gonna just hop into Home Goods and go look around real quick. I literally stepped foot into Home Goods for like 30 seconds. I get a phone call. Hey, Nora, uh, excuse me. Um, you know, your nail tech is running a little bit behind the person she was doing. Oh my God, why am I like burping so much? The person that she was doing their nails didn't like the color. So do you mind if she does your nails at 1130? And I'm like, well, yes, I do mind because my appointment was at 11. Like, that's fucking annoying. But at the same time, I need to get my nails done and I'm already here. So I went into Target as well. But your girl's trying to be good and not spend money on stuff that she doesn't need. So now it's, what time is it? Why, why is my watch tripping? Oh, please hold. Weird. My watch is dead, but I'm pretty sure I charged it last night. So either it fell off the charger, I didn't put it on properly. I have no fucking clue, but it's 11 o'clock now. So I'm like, bro, I still have another 30 minutes before I have to go inside and I'm just annoyed. So I'm just sitting here, people watching because I've already gone into Home Goods. I already went to Marshalls. I already went to Target. And I mean, I saw stuff, but again, I didn't come here to like go shopping and buy stuff like self-control. Okay. All 2021. Um... So I'm just sitting here in the car, scrolling social media. I'm like, my hair is all over the place, looking like a lion's mane. Perfectly fine, no one got hurt. Um, wearing my Melody Ashani hoodie. Uh, this color is not available anymore, but if she does have like the same hoodie, like in different colors or whatever, I'll link it down below for you guys, but it's not available anymore. But yes, this hoodie is from Melody Ashani. Um, 
glasses obviously you guys already know my go-to's key australia x desi perkins no longer available i'm sorry i know i wear these all the time and people ask me pretty often and when i say people like four people including my mom <laughs> four people four people including my mom asked me but for the other three i'm sorry i wear it all the time i love them but yes they are no longer available so i'm rambling um your girl's just gonna sit here i probably will go in like 15 minutes early since i have to like soak my nails anyways so all right so nails are done i am back in the car it's kind of hard for you guys to see it here with the light and stuff oh there you go. okay you can kind of see it there if you can I will show it to you guys more once I get home, but listen, my nail tech snapped, okay? One thing Zoe gonna do is snap. So your girl is in the car now, um, going to head home. I am no longer shooting today with my cousin, so I'm just gonna head home now, um, get ready, do my makeup for the day, and then we will be heading over to my aunt's house, Faye's house, for uh, my cousin's daughter's second birthday. We're celebrating Ryan's birthday today, so yeah let's get home all right so i made it back home and i just wanted to show you guys my nails a little bit better so i feel like yes you can really see it when i tell you what is that what was that accent <laughs> when i tell you guys my nail tech always snaps like snaps she goes in i freaking love it so i just get my natural nails these are my natural nails dip powder and then just the white lines that you see on top are in gel but that's the only thing that's gel and then she just did the dip uh top coat so it's literally all dip on my natural nails and then we just did the gel for the lines but love them so i'm gonna eat something real quick because it is two o'clock now um that whole morning took way longer than it should have, but I'm gonna eat something now real quick and then start getting ready uh, to, as I mentioned, head over to Faye's house because I think the birthday party is at four. Um, so I still need to leave here, get gas, grab a gift because obviously I hate when people go to kids' per like. I hate when people go to kids' birthday parties and just assume because it's a kids' party they don't have to bring anything, and it's like. No, you need to bring a gift. So I need to stop and grab a gift, get gas, and then head out. So I will probably check in with you guys once I am all dressed and ready to go to show you what I am wearing because I have no clue what that is. All right, guys, so I am all dressed. Oh, I almost forgot my watch. Hold on. I almost forgot my watch. So it is 3.33, getting ready to head out now. Um, so for outfit, I'm wearing this leather blazer from Shein. You guys saw that haul. Uh, jeans are from PacSun. They're just like black high-waisted denim. I really like this like kind of like faded type of wash. It was similar to the ones I wore yesterday from Gap, but these are from PacSun. Bodysuit is from Forever 21 and then just my same Public Desire boots. Whenever I really don't know what to wear, all black is the way to go. So I am all dressed up now, getting ready to head out. Typical makeup that I always do. This is like my go-to. I feel good. I feel like it looks good. It goes with everything. Um, so I'm gonna head out now, just grab gas. And then, um, yeah, I will check in with you guys probably when I get to the birthday party. So of course I make it, ooh, look at this, this freaking lighting. Put my makeup on. So we made it to the house. <laughs> Obviously, Fifi told me four o'clock. I got here at 4.10. I was sweating that I was going to be Patient late. Patient people time. Nobody's Patient doing anything. People Nobody's time. doing anything. Oh, I'm connected to the Bluetooth still in my car. It's going to stop you? No, it's not the video. Nah, no, no, no. It was still oh. recording. But yeah, fifth in line. She told me to come at 4 o'clock. I came at 4.10. I was That's scared that I was said. running late. And she's still over here talking about you still have to do your makeup. Our cousin literally said the party starts at 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So nobody knows the time. <laughs> So now I'm just in Fifth's studio, as you guys can see, a little sneak peek. Sneak peek, I can't give you, whoop, can't yeah, give y'all everything. My can't give you guys everything, but you know, nice little my sneak peek. I just love this corner. Yeah. Oh my I, God. And the, oh, these were the shelves you were talking about, the floating shelves? Yeah, but you know, one of them, you gotta work on it. Books yeah. are so heavy. Oh, right there. Yeah. Yeah, this is cute. Yeah. So yeah, we're about to get into it with the party. I'm about to chill with the fam. You already know I had to bring me a little road soda. White Claw sponsor me. Road um, soda. My nails are freaking fire, bro. No, they're crazy. Like, yeah, so I was like, oh wow. Fire. Snapped. Like, yeah, she snapped. Zoe that, snapped. That shit's a fire. She she really does what she has to do. Oh my God. 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 O
To make grill, I say, well, I heard that no one's coming. And no, make... we love grill. No, but she doesn't need grill because. Uh... Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> this is Sunday. This is a Sunday face. Um, happy Valentine's Day. Yes, happy Valentine's Day. I actually really like this holiday. Um, I don't know. I love love. I'm a sap, you know, I'm just, I love love. So happy Valentine's day. Um, I'm going to wrap up the vlog here. Um, still a little bit tired, a little bit groggy. So just going to have my coffee, probably going to watch, um, a sermon right now and then just enjoy some, some YouTube. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I feel like a lot happened. Yeah, I feel like a lot happened. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, as always, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And follow your girl on Instagram. Um, and yeah. Oh,